Hello everyone. Today we are going to learn about Nestler's solution or reagent and we will also learn how to prepare Nestler's solution or reagent and we will also learn how to use Nestler Nestler's solution to detect ammonia, right? So let's get started. What is Nestler solutions solution Nestler solution uh, is the basic is the alkaline solution of potassium tetra iodo mercurate right potassium potassium tetra iodo mercurate so what is Nestler solution or reagent the alkaline solution of potassium potassium tetraidomarcurate right is called the Nestler solution let me say you this Nestler solution is the alkaline solution of potassium tetraidomarcurate right here the oxidation state of mercury is 2 tetraidomarcurate complex compound right and potassium hydroxide or sodium hydroxide Nestler solution is the alkaline solution of potassium tetraidomarcurate complex compound and potassium hydroxide and sodium hydroxide this is complex compound right preparation how to prepare Nestler solution or reagent well if you add potassium iodide slowly to the solution of mercury chloride then red precipitate of mercury iodide and soluble potassium chloride is formed right and again if you add potassium uh, iodide right iodide to this solution then potassium iodide will react with mercuric iodide and to form a soluble colorless complex compound called potassium tetraidomarcurate right then the after forming this compound we we add potassium hydroxide or sodium hydroxide to this solution to make it alkaline the alkaline solution of the complex compound potassium tetraidomarcurate is called Nestler solution or reagent right what is the use of Nestler solution Nestler solution is used to detect the presence of ammonia and ammonium compounds. So, what is the main uses of Nestler solution? The uses of Nestler, Nestler solution is, e, is to detect the presence of ammonia and ammonium, ammonium compound. This is ammonia, right? This is ammonia and ammonium compound this is ammonium however let me observe here this is potassium right and this is mercury this is 2 plus and iodide 1 minus right so here will be 4 right 4 iodide so we are getting here 2 minus so here we have to add 2 however this is not the matter okay now we'll apply Nestler solution to detect ammonia right well when this is Nestler so reagents when Nestler uh, Nest Nestler's reagent is as a added to the solution of ammonium salt right ammonium salt like ammonium chloride then alkali present in Nestler's reagent 
right alkali present in nestor resin react with ammonia salt to produce ammonia gas here is ammonia gas right so ammonia gas then the ammonia gas will react with potassium tetrahydromercuryate complex producing a brown precipitate of ammonia ammo amino mercuric iodide this is amino amino mercuric iodide right this is this the, the color of this compound is brown and it is called melons base right melons press so by the change of color we can detect detect the presence of ammonia right so thank you for viewing this video be well